Joel Corey is a bad music producer, and he is about 25% of the reason as to why I think Love Island is secretly a pit of hell that demons come out of. Because of this, I should be inclined to think that everything he's ever made has sucked, and I do not like Lonely, Out Out, Bed, and especially Sorry, but Head and Heart just clicks with me, and I'm glad that it has, because it's the most successful song I've talked about since Blinding Lights. This shit is huge. The drop on this song is much better than other John Corey songs because the bass hits are strong enough to give an actual sense of payoff. It's not the same terribly weak sound that you hear on his first two singles. It also revived the career of Emanike, who, like Jason Derulo, looked like he was on his last legs, but this gave him his biggest hit ever. Add in some juicy house chords and this is the summer house anthem to end them all. And I like it a decent amount, 7 out of 10.